Tonight was a big night here in Tuscaloosa for the LSU Tigers as they defeated the Alabama Crimson Tide 46-41. By doing so, they ended an eight-year-long losing streak and continue their undefeated record this season. The champion mindset has been with this team all season, and it is the explosive offense that further enforces it. The Tiger offense was able to gain a 20-point lead over rival Alabama, all within the first half of the game. Wide receivers Justin Jefferson and Jamar Chase put on a good show for LSU, with Jefferson having 79 yards and Chase with 140 yards and a touchdown. Tonight we just showed that we are a dominant offense and uh, that we can score points on a, a big-time team. So that's definitely a, a great thing for us. Freshman kicker Cade York also helped the Tigers gain the big lead by kicking a 40-yard and a 45-yard field goal in the first half of the game. Although LSU quickly gained the big lead, the Crimson Tide did not fail at keeping them on their toes and fans at the edges of their seats. Alabama quarterback and Heisman Trophy candidate Tua Tagovailoa threw for 418 yards against the Tiger defense and allowed the Tide to catch up in touchdowns. It seemed as if every time the Crimson Tide started to get closer to taking over the game, the Tigers responded and maintained the lead. Another key factor to LSU's offensive performance was running back Clyde edwards Alaire. The 5'8 Baton Rouge native went for 104 rushing yards and 77 yards receiving, with a total of four touchdowns this game. He was doubted highly in the recruiting process because of his size, but Edwards Alaire proves that size does not matter. You know, I had had that doubt coming into LSU. Oh, uh, he's not big enough. He's not going. He's not going to be fast enough. But you know, you can. You can. Everybody can can measure. You know, the things they see, but they can't measure your heart. And you know, that's what I live by. That's my motto. This big win for the Tigers was led by senior quarterback and Heisman Trophy frontrunner Joe Burrow. Burrow had 393 passing yards and went 31 for 39 in completion. Burrow also carried the ball for 64 rushing yards. The LSU Tigers will head to Ole Miss next Saturday to face the Bulldogs at 6 p.m. Central. For Tiger TV Sports, I'm Bree Andrus.